Does anybody know what's going on? Is she paying us even though the play's dead? Like, what happened to all the money that she raised? I think if she was gonna pay us, she would've just sent a check. This must be about something else. Man, this fucking sucks! What? I feel like I should give you detention. I'm an adult. <laughs> no, but seriously, why did she call us here? It's because I had something to say. Hi, everybody. Thanks for coming. Um, I really wanted to apologize just for, um, I don't know, just keeping you in limbo of this Jack Conway thing. I've come to the decision that The Merchant with the Jufro is no longer happening. I called up the theaters, I canceled the uh, rehearsal and performance dates. So what's going on? It's for the best. And that doesn't mean we're not going to be doing anything at all. I decided I want to put up Darlene's play. My play? Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, I finally got around to reading it. And I'm really sorry for being such a jerk about everything. I mean, it's amazing. It's better than anything I've ever written, that's for sure. Billy, you're admitting that Darlene is better than you? Well, apparently it's not that hard to be. I... I don't know what to say. This is... Wow, are you sure? Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure. You know, I've been thinking a lot about when you guys came over, and you were talking about how much this play meant to you, and how I should really have reevaluated my life, and uh, I really think that my talents lie in producing. And I mean, we have the makings here of a really little great LGBT theater group, so... Actually, I'm, I'm straight. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're straight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really, I'm, I'm straight. Okay, we all believe you, like how you're Jewish, right? <laughs> but... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> anyway, I think this is going to be really, really incredible. I mean, we have one amazing writer, two very talented, one very dedicated actor, and me, a young, budding producer. I think the five of us can do uh, something. Great. Hello. Oh, Cheyenne, I didn't see you back there. Yeah. Uh, I thought you called me here because you were gonna return my camera. Anyway, the six of us are going to do great things. Together, it won't just be your great accomplishment. Yeah. Yeah. All of us together. Good. <laughs> Uh, no, seriously, I thought you called me here because you were going to... I'm really to excited to do Darlene's play. I know, right? <laughs> Hello, can anyone hear me? But I don't think we have enough girls, and no, who gets to play the sun? Well, I was thinking that you would be great as little Christian. Ooh, you are perfect casting. As for the actresses, I think we're just going to have to hold some casting calls, right? Have some auditions. Mm -hmm. That's where you're going to come in, Cheyenne. Where I come in? Yeah, I mean, you did a really amazing job with the vlogs and the videos and getting performance spaces, so... I'd like to bring you on as my assistant. In an official way, that is. Official as in you'll be officially paying me? Well, that remains to be seen. I mean, I would like to. I know I've kind of treated you like my lap dog. Yeah, kind of. Okay, you know what? I'm trying to be more respectful of you. Okay, that's what I'm trying to say. Okay. Okay, thank you. I'm going to go on to some brass tack stuff. so far. You did all of this already? Oh, yeah, well, you know me, I like a good plan. Mm. And I really want to do whatever I can to put this up. I mean, the script is really amazing. And it will be even more amazing when I'm involved! Okay, that was a joke, I'm kidding. <laughs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Here's what I've got so far. Uh, 